When Adrian walked in, I was extremely shocked. I mean, he looks fantastic. Hello, how are you? Well, thanks. How are you? You guys look great. Absolutely amazing. Hello, how are you? I was over the moon to see him. I was like, oh my, oh my God, <laughs> what are you doing here? Yeah, you too. We weren't expecting that one. <laughs> Last year I followed Adro's journey pretty closely because it was such a heroic effort. Adro, how do you feel? <laughs> the underdog, you know, coming through and ending up with a win. It was inspiring, you know? I'm just hoping I can do the same. Today I wanted to come back to the White House to speak to the Final Four. I know that when that was me and it was my turn and the end of the game was, was coming near, I was at wit's end, you know. Just just keep focused because one of you guys is going to be the winner and if there was one, one week where nothing else mattered, this would be it. It was great getting advice from Adrian. I mean, he was the winner from last year. He knows exactly what it takes to get to the end. He knows the pressure, the impatience, the frustration that all four of us have at the moment being in the final four and having time to kind of look back on it and reflect on it. He had some really good advice for us. That was the one thing that I found out because, I mean, I didn't, when I came in, like I said, I didn't think that I was going to make it. I didn't think I was going to win. To me, if you, if you win The Biggest Loser and you gain the weight back, well, you don't make the changes forever and in 12 months you're, you're looking just as big as you were originally. You, know, you haven't won for anything. It gives me a lot of hope in myself that um, someone who worked so hard like Adro has still kept his weight off a year on. Physically, he's looking spectacular. Let me tell you guys, it's so much easier to maintain than it was to lose it. Really? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yep, it's so much easier. So much easier to keep a hold of one or two kilos yeah. now than 60 kilos back then. In many ways, for me personally, it was great to see Adro and hear what he had to say. It's very exciting. Very exciting. It is. It's not scary. scary. It's not scary, <laughs> no way. Positive affirmation, just tell yourself, you know, the, uh, see yourself winning and you'll win. Meeting Adro has really inspired me in the fact that he's just come across as such a nice guy and he's been there before, he's done it all, he's won it, you know, he's a champion. And um, it just... It gives you hope, you know? That's what I want to be in a couple of months' time. That's what I'm aiming for, you know?